if you have clicked on this video then i'm assuming you have a lot of your portrait images that you want to kind of stylize you want to create watercolor images out of it hand drawings out of it or illustrations or 3d characters this is what you can create with the new image and models available on vertex ai do you have to be a coder to create this well the answer is no let me jump directly to the video and show you how amazing the prerequisite for this particular video is that you have a build gcp account enabled you have vertex ai enabled and that is all that you require once you have everything enabled all you have to do is you have to upload the image which i have already done you have to click on toggle panel parameters here is where you can kind of do different things all together with the image and models so you can insert something you can remove something you can outpaint something if there is a product background that you want to kind of change then even that is possible if you want to control something in the image even that is possible but what i'll kind of focus today on is personalize so when you click on personalize there are different styles that are available so let me start off with 3d characters here is where you have different safety parameters that you can kind of tweak around and if there are constraints in terms of where the data should reside for the entire processing then you can choose different areas wherein you want the entire processing to happen so this is something that you can control i'll stick to the default value and i'll click on generate while the generation is happening if you had to do this using an open source solution then you would have to fine tune a stable diffusion based model and again that was a very tedious task to do but here you can get amazing 3d characters created for your input image with just a button click and here you have the results so i'll quickly so i'll quickly unhide the panel this is the first image this is the second image this is the third image and this is the fourth image it's doing a decent job in terms of creating the output let me try a different version right now so if i say if i want so if i want illustration this is the illustration from the base image so it takes that particular base image and starts creating illustrations out of it so if i go back and take the original image which is this particular image what i'll do right now is i'll go to personalize i'll now click on illustration and now when i generate i'll have better illustrations coming out because it's not from a 3d character right this is how simple it is to create amazing illustrations 3d characters or hand drawings out of your portrait images i'll also show you a small demo around the hand drawing piece as well so let's wait for the illustration to load so this is the illustration now imagine if i like this particular image or you have different illustrations here this is also one illustration so if i like this particular image and if i want to kind of use it for my use cases if i want to download this i can click on export image save your generated images with digital watermarks to your local drive i can upscale the image to a factor of say 2x or 4x so i'll click on 2x and i'll export this particular image now this particular original image now these were the illustrations if i want to create hand drawing from the original image i'll click on hand drawing and i'll press generate and this are the hand drawing versions of the solution so what i've shown you is a capability all possible with a button click now imagine if you want to kind of do this entire process using python code then there are sample notebooks that i'll attach a link in the video itself which you can utilize so you can basically control the style the safety parameters and what the output should be uh, all of this is something that you can control using python code i wanted to keep it very generic so if you are someone who wants to create some amazing illustrations of your own photograph using say the original images that you have and you want to do this without writing any piece of code then Google's Vertex AI solution is something that you should definitely try out. This is all that I had in today's video. I hope you enjoyed today's video. Thank you so much for watching the video.